All right, guys, welcome back to another episode. So I was just unpacking uh, everything out of the boat, getting it all ready to put in the water, and I'm meeting a friend down here, and um, he's just caught an octopus and it's pulled his lure into a hole just up here while he's waiting for me. So I'm um, going to grab some equipment to uh, help him get his lure back. <laughs> Off to a great start straight away. <laughs> he needs a glove and a knife. So yeah, we'll go see if we can help him out. What a beautiful morning it is this morning. Look at that. Ho, 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 ho. I got myself a new GoPro 12 for uh, for Christmas, so that's what I'll be using today because I drowned my other one. Got the tiniest little bit of water in it and it just rusted out literally straight away. Like It was like rusty the next day. So yeah, that one's dead now. I've got a new one. So I'll be using the 12 from now on, which is pretty cool. There he is. <laughs> oh God. Got off to a little bit of a late start this morning, but um, it's been pretty shitty weather for the last couple of days. Um, yeah, at the time of filming this is a couple of days after, oh, well, it's, yeah, the second. So, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year's for everyone. You guys probably won't see this for a couple of weeks. I've got a few episodes to um, upload first, but yeah, I hope everyone had a good Chrissy and a, a safe one. and. Everyone got out on the water to go do some fishing. Get a little bit done ourselves now, which is good. Here he is. Richo! <laughs> what are you doing, mate? He's got himself an octopus. <laughs> How did you manage catching an octopus, bro? Did you have a little bit of octopus in here? Oh, yeah, I see oh, oh, you got him. I've snagged him. You've got him. Wait, I can't fight him he's too strong wow i don't want to donate that lure no do you so i don't really know what the plan is um he's under a little rock if we can lift that rock that might expose him but okay i kind of don't want to get there too. he's right there might just better slide the knife under him and give him a little snip give him no oh, just try and just try and case him out a little bit you reckon even yeah maybe oh he's got me oh, he oh, <laughs> he <did. laughs> We yeah. got him. <laughs> so I don't know what the plan is. Don't let him back in there. Oh, there we go. There he goes. He got it back. See you, mate. Oh. Sorry for the bother. <laughs> there you go, bro. <laughs> That's the camouflage. Oh, wow. He's, we've been squirted straight <laughs> up. <laughs> there he is, just in there. If you can see him. I won't, I won't hurt him or anything, but he's pulling all those shells over the top of him if, as right, protection. Man. So there's a shell just there and another one there. That's how you find him. Yeah. You're looking for octopus. Find a pile of shells that looks a bit well, unnatural. And... There you go. All right, we'll leave this little one go. <laughs> See you, buddy. <laughs> hey, welcome back to another hey, episode, hey, buddy. Guys, <laughs> oh, God. I hadn't even like finish getting the boat ready and then I get a phone call off Rich, eh? Hey buddy, <laughs> caught an octopus and I don't want to lose my lure. <laughs> Come and help me. <laughs> Today we're going to be chasing, uh, Rich has been hunting some whiting lately, so. On the surface. On the surface, we're going to be doing a little bit of whiting fishing and um, maybe even try and get some squid. Um, drop a couple of big baits down. I wouldn't mind a, a Jew or a really big flatty. Um, yeah, I want to take some fish home for dinner tonight. So, yeah, that's the plan. We've got, I've got a couple of traps as well, so we'll be chucking some traps in and uh, try and get some blues from the crabs. But hopefully everything hasn't been smashed over Christmas and there's not much around, but I'm sure we'll find something today, eh? Yeah, we'll be something out there. There'll be something there. I'm going to get some flathead. I seen flathead at the co-op the other day for... Like um, $79. Seventy nine yeah. dollars a kilo for flathead. Yeah. It's like, are you kidding me? <laughs> so, yeah, each flathead, each kilo of flathead we get, seventy nine dollars. That's cash, dollar dollar bills, yo. <laughs> That's mortgage payment, right? <laughs> That's it, yeah, paying off the mortgage with some flathead pellets. All right, but I'll um, flash back to when we're in the boat. Yo. Oh yeah, bungs are in. There she goes. 
Beautiful. Are you going to do it first pull? Oh, oh baby. Oh, you never let me down, do you? You sexy thing. <laughs> So we're going to chuck some crab pots in. Richo and myself just set one up here now. There you go. Going to chuck some bait in the bottom there. I've got some old whiting um, uh, that I've had in the freezer for a while. So that's what we're going to put on. And um, just going to put it along this bank here. There's a nice big weed section right along there. So hopefully it's a couple of blue swimmers swimming past. And we can get a good feed. We've got four traps. So yeah, hopefully they clean up. Pot number one. Uh, Quick, send it. Yeah, that's got him. Crab trap number two. Straight in. Boom. Crab trap number three. Three. Yeah, it is Christmas time, so we're definitely gonna have to keep an eye on people. Um, yeah, checking our traps. But we're going to fish around the area anyway, and if we see anyone checking them, um, yeah, it's going to be a couple of uh, couple of words spoken. So we'll check, get this last pot in, and um, and then we're going to have a fish. Might even go for a little drive over on some flat somewhere. Rich, I really want some uh, some whiting, so we're going to try and get him some whiting. I'd love a nice big flathead. For, uh, for dinner and some uh, and some squid as well. Yeah, I love some squid. Yeah, send it. All right. Crab trap number four. Oh uh, yeah, and that was all one. Right, so we, we threw our fourth crab trap in, and um, yeah, the the buoy must have been tangled. It's gone under the water a little bit. So what we'll do is, um, it's coming low tide. We've put them in a location where we'll, we'll, we'll still be able to find it. Um, if not, we'll drag some big hooks around, yeah. hopefully. Hopefully pick it up. <laughs> but now we're going to do some fishing. We're going to come in here around these flats. I mean, there's boats absolutely everywhere. So trying to get a fish around some of these areas would be good, but we're going to try anyway. Oh, this is so heavy compared to my other setup. <laughs> I wonder how many times this spot's been peppered this morning. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> over the past two weeks. Oh, I reckon. Oh, man, Might have to check a little vibe on, I think. Yeah, I think the same. I'm just liking the way this is swimming over the top of that weed edge there. Yeah, yeah, there's some. Just a nice light roll. Big flatty sitting there. Surely. I just don't know if there's enough weight on it, but. Yeah, right. Alrighty. We have a little bit of a drift, and we'll just keep that doing that all day today, and if we find a little patch of squid we'll have a bit of a squid fish for a while and um, yeah I wouldn't mind a bit of a feed of squid actually they're even good for really good for bait too so we'll um, see if we can get a couple for bait first drop a couple down it's always a good chance that you get a really big flathead or a dew and um, yeah then we'll keep a bit of a feed for lunch what do you reckon? absolutely salt and pepper squid salt and pepper squid you'll be beauty that like that. 
Gotta get something, Rich, eh? Got it, mate. It's to be done. Crab trap number one. Nothing? Nothing? Nothing. Drop him back in. Yeah, that was... There it is. Anything? Nah. Nothing. Oh, well. So, we just checked uh, two traps. Nothing in the first two. Hopefully we can find the other one that's uh, the boys going under the water. Yeah, the other ones are around the other side. They haven't really been soaking for that long. We just thought, ah, oh, we'll give them a quick, quick check. But um, what do you want to do now, Richo? Oh, I'm a bit of bait fishing. Bit of bait fishing. Yeah, yep. All right, eh? All right, we're going to do a little bit of bait fishing. Drop down some bloody, uh, I've got a pilly on, half a pilly, and what do you got, Richard? Oh, worms and prawns, mate. Got, we got some worms and prawns as well, so we might just do a bit, little bit of drifting. Hopefully we can come up with a nice big flatty. Uh, some tailor, sorry, not tailor, whiting maybe. And, uh, yeah, get a good feed for tonight. All right, let's get it going. Whew. Along this, this edge here, like you can sort of see where it drops down, comes back up. There's definitely, um, we're definitely on some flats on that here. Yeah. Oh, what? Seven point. You can see where it comes up in that here, but. Yeah. We'll have a bit of a fish anyway. What do you reckon? Yeah, we're well, here now. Have a bird. I thought it was shallower than that. Alright, so while we're uh, having a little bit of a drift, going to uh, cast some vibes and that around. That's it. This is where, if you're going to get a big flatty, this is where you get it out here. Let's go, Richo. What we got? Big little snapper. Oh, wow. a little brimbo. Delish. <laughs> you do that one? Alright, it's not a donut. <laughs> it's not a donut. <laughs> yeah, a little donut. Little tie one. One. Very closely related to brim. Get him back hey. in there. Off you go. See ya, bro. <laughs> Alright, fish on the board. It's not big, I can tell you that much. Something having a go. Yeah, little brimbo. Another tie one. Oh. Oh, yeah. Wouldn't want some bigger ones. Yeah. Taiwan's beautiful. Quite a um, 43 Taiwan. Oh. He's alright. And they've certainly, um, they fight a bit harder than yeah. them I find. That's hard. Uh, the tip of that rod seems really yeah. sensitive yeah, too. Yeah, it is. It's, um, got a little bit of saddleback syndrome. Oh, bloody something. Something's had a go at him. Yeah. Uh, get back. Oh, straight on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the reel's jamming up on you. Yeah, I think it's yeah, yeah, a little flounder. <laughs> there you go. These species? Yeah. Yeah, pity it's not bigger. What do you got, a little one? Oh, you got your whiting. You got your whiting. Who <laughs> yeah. got his whiting? Am I filming? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, doggy. Yeah, got me whiting. He got his whiting. Yes. <laughs> Call the missus. <laughs> Call the missus. <laughs> Big dog's done it. <laughs> Shame he's way too small. <laughs> oh, dude. There you go. There you go. See you, little, little boy. Choo. See you, bird. Let's go, baby. Take us to the dreamland. 
Let's say it. Bit of way? Just yeah. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Throw it back in. Make sure it's not all. Yeah. Well, that's a big fat zero on the crab. Number one crab, zero. We uh, we've lost our other crab pot. We don't can't find where it is. So um, rope's gotten tangled up. We might have to put some. Some big hooks on and see if we can scale drag some hooks along to get it back in. But whereabouts we had it is another thing, man. Like, uh, yeah, I had my head down. It's a little bit of a, a little bit of a bummer, but I can't see it under the water or anything, can you? It was definitely around here somewhere. It wasn't past the boy, eh? Yeah. Look in. I don't even know how deep we are. Oh no. <laughs> We've had a shocker. Anyway, we're going to look around for it a little bit, see if we can jag it up. <laughs> oh man, we are not putting him in the right spots, bro. Nah. Bring him in. Nothing. Yes. Nah. I pulled him in before and there's like a crab on top of the trap. Oh yeah. Jumps off. We probably put him in the most stupid spots ever. Yeah. Let's see if we can find this other one. Oh, all right. Crabbing, crabbing was a, uh, a failure. Uh, we've dropped the crab pots off. We're gonna go try and get some whiting on the flats now. Soon as Richo sorts out this boat situation. Yeah, let's have a look. All right, we're back. We're back. Got a little bit of bloody claret. A little bit of a casualty. Where are we going now? We're gonna go try over around these islands right, and that. The island. Yeah. Get out the wind. Yeah. Knock some fades, flick some vibes. I'm gonna come up this other side. Might as well put that surface one back on. Yeah. I'm gonna come up this other side of this this uh, boy here. Around there and we're gonna go up in around these islands. So cruise up around the islands. And hopefully get some get some whiting. We need some whiting and some flathead. Anything. I would take anything right now. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna get in the water and uh, keep trying until we get them. Let's get into them. Get around them. Get amongst them. Get amongst them. Oh, <laughs> oh God, we've lost it. <laughs> We go pull ourselves up onto this bloody bank over here yeah. and we can walk around. What do you reckon? Right. Let's do it. Right. Get your bloody whiting into it. Oh, yeah. Right? Yeah. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we have no idea what's going on here. We literally have, what do you reckon? 30 plus whiting? Good. Good, like big model fish. Good, good elbow slapper fish. They haven't hit a lure, they're not hitting top water, they're not hitting prawns, they're not hitting worms. What? But honestly, it's probably literally there, yeah, like, uh, we have no idea what's going on. I don't know if you can see that in the water there, but all in front of us and to the right are just whiting everywhere. Even behind us, they're literally all <laughs> they're literally just swimming past and not not touching our bait, prawns, worms, nothing. It is the middle of the tide. 
so maybe they're just not hitting but they seem to be splashing on the top of the water as well so i don't know what they're doing there you think they'd be feeding on something small but anyway we're gonna keep trying oh if we can just get one i'll be happy with one or if imagine if they just literally all of a sudden just come on oh my god we've just got whiting galore beautiful feet of whiting would be delicious we'll keep trying but it's very 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 bizarre though eh? i've never seen whiting like that and not hit a prawn or a, a piece of bloody you know beach worm anyway we'll keep trying <laughs> Got the net. All right, we're on. Let's go, Richo. Yes. That's no, a dart. It's a dart, isn't it? Or a brim. It's a brimbo. Oh. Oh, well, that's that's a keeper brimbo. It is a keeper brimbo. I'll take it. I get. I'll take it. You! <laughs> I thought oh, I, I, I was like this. <laughs> well, I thought for sure, man. I thought that was a whiting. I was like, uh, oh. oh. Got him. Got him. One keeper brim. Uh, oh, we thought it was a whiting. <laughs> <laughs> Would have been a good one. I feel like with all the whiting here, I'm like, it has to be a thumper. Oh my god. Bloody <laughs> brim. There's, there's, there's probably. 50, 50 good sized whiting around us. I'm just, we've tried squid, prawns, oh, worms, worms pilchards, surface lures. Surface lures. Vibes. I've tried a vibe, and they're just, they're, they're just not hitting it. Like it just doesn't, it doesn't make sense. Either they're mating or. Because they're, they're splashing, they're busting up, yeah. like. They're chasing each other. They're chasing each other. I reckon that they, they, they might just be, you know, they might just be hunting the, uh, you know, a bit of whiting puss. Like they just don't want the, they don't want any food. Uh, <laughs> anyway, that's it. That's a wrap. We're done. We've tried everything. We're hungry. We're gonna go to the pub, get a lunch and a beer. Why not? Hope you guys enjoyed. Wasn't much of an episode, but yeah. We'll, uh, we'll try again another day. See you on the next one. Cheers, guys.